These flowers are called moon dance. And I think there's a reason for them if you look at the time of day. The sun's getting ready to set over there. And these guys just light up the evening. Yeah, this is the view uh, from uh, the Rose Garden in Loose Park. You can tell the evening, the sun's going down. The blue sky above us. And there's flowers. Okay. I think I see Vic and Kenzie over there in the distance. We're going to have to go find out what they're up to. So, I wonder what the... Yeah, the moon flowers look very nice. The red ones are much darker. I don't see what kind of red ones they are. The yellow ones are great too, if you've not been over there. Before I go to Vic, I'll show you some of these yellow ones. The pink in the middle. I was sitting at that bench here a little bit ago and I was sitting over here and enjoying the view of the different flowers and that kind of gazebo like thing over there. See the pink flower in between the yellow ones that kind of stands out. My favorite ones are the oranges but the orange don't flower uh, roses don't show up this time of night. See if we can see Vic and Kenzie down there. There's Vic and Kenzie. As I said, we'll sneak down there in a moment. <clears throat> My family. It's a humid evening, but it's getting cooler now that the sun's gone down, of course. Oh, that's a pretty one. I like it. I wonder what kind of yellow one that is. Um, should have the name right over here. The name is Julia Child. Floribunda. I wonder why it's called the Julia Child. She was a cook, uh, cooking expert. American TV icon. Julia Child. That's cool. And the pink ones are Our Lady of Guadalupe. Hmm. That makes sense. Hello. These are, hello. And these are walking on sunshine flowers. Some look a little lighter than the others, but they're older, I guess. I think we're getting the reflection of the sunset over there. Yeah. Building here. So these ones smell nice. I call them yellow rose of Texas flowers, but the walking on sunshine is their given name. Again, this is a, excuse me. This is Kevin Stoda and welcome to the Kevin Stoda channel. Yeah, we're looking out here. Um, we talked about those moon flowers a little bit ago. There's the moon right up there. In the middle of the picture, it barely shows up. And we're back to our roses. These are tiny little white flowers of roses. Uh, again, they've taken quite a heat today. It was very humid most of the last couple of days after rain on Sunday. Oh, there they are.
Oh, I see my wife and my daughter over there. See them on the left side? I'm waving, but they're ignoring me. Hi, Vic. Hi, Kenzie. Kenzie's a talkative one, like me. She's gonna get in trouble. <laughs> they found a bunny or a rabbit. There was somebody's having a celebration over there, a birthday. Except in uh, castles in Europe, or palaces, or gardens, I really saw a rose garden like this. Um, and Zweibrook in Junior, Germany was the only place that had one. Seen like this. There's that girl. I see her. I see her. I got 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 her. Come on. I'm playing tick. Come on. Let me play tick. Come on. Let me talk. Oh. What is Vic doing over there? Oh, she's looking for a rabbit. Uh oh, Kenzie, she ran away. I'll get her. I'll get her upstairs. She's running away. Oh, I'll get you. Take, take. You're not a bunny. Why are you hopping? Where is the bunny? Oh. Oh, I'm sorry, Bunny. I'm sorry, Bunny. I see him now. There he is. It is a tiny bunny. You guys see it there? He's barely moving. I don't think you can see him. He's in the center of the screen, but maybe the eyeball. Give you a zoom on him. You see him now? Mm -hmm. Yeah, she shouldn't do that. Bye-bye, buddy.